Our praises to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Mikah Kodash, the honest to the apostles and the elders of the Great Millstone for teaching us this truth. Today's lesson is entitled Drone Insects Caught Spying on Africa. Now, as you can see, this is Esau Edom has no limitation to his wickedness, man. You know? Which we all know he's been always uh you know cloning different animals and so on and so forth, even you know uh replacing uh humans you know with uh what do they call them uh manufacturing or uh, uh different people's body and putting them out there to be that specific person and to get rid of the person which uh I, I can't think of the actual name they've been doing but They've been cloning, basically. They've been cloning humans. And now Esau Edom is cloning cloning insects. Uh, I have one, maybe two precepts. Uh, basically one precept. And uh, I'm going to let this video play. It's only a few seconds. We'll come back with a few, uh, with that one precept. Lord willing, it's edifying to the flock. Hmm. All right, guys. Imagine that, right? Yeah, that's the Esau Eater, man. Uh, but yeah, that's basically all I wanted to show you guys. Uh, let's go ahead and get that precept. Uh, let's see. Yeah, this is the book of Ezekiel, chapter 38, and verse 4. It says, verse 3, it says, Behold, Thou art wiser than Daniel. There is no secret that they can hide from thee. And that's talking about the so-called white man. No secret can be hidden from him. You know, um, he's going into all these uh, uh, different diligent search, you know, to clone men, women, uh, animals, and now insects. It says, with thy wisdom and with thy, with thy understanding, thou hast gotten these riches. And has gotten gold and silver into thy treasure, by the great wisdom, and by the uh, by the traffic, has thou increased thy riches, and thy heart is lifted up because of thy riches. And you can see that, man. You know, starting with the uh, the bankers, man, the central bankers. It says, therefore, thus said the Lord Yahweh by Shimei Abishai, because thou hast set thy heart as the heart of God. See, and that's definitely what he's been doing, man. As you see that video with the the insect, man. You know, he's he's made it a a a, a machine or a, a robot, basically. Verse seven, it says, "Behold, therefore I will bring strangers upon thee, the terrible of the nation, and they shall draw these their swords against the beauty of thy wisdom, and they shall defile thy brightness." Verse eight, they shall bring thee down to the pit, and thou shalt die the death of them that are slain in the midst of a uh, midst of the seas. You know, so that's basically what let's get nine. It says without without yet say before him that slay thee, I am a God. But thou shall be a man and no God and in the hand of him that slayeth thee. See, that's what it is, man. The most high has pumped up Esau's, you know, pride to think that, you know, he can't be touched, you know, with the uh uh with the wisdom and knowledge on the left hand side, you know, and, and his riches, man, you know. But the most high is gonna bring him down, man. You know? So with that being said, I'm gonna give all praises and honor to Yahweh Bashim Yahushai, Bahashim, Bakar Kodash, double honors to the apostles and the elders of the great millstone for teaching us this truth. And shalom to the hopeful elect.